Canola School on realagriculture.com is brought to you by Alberta Canola Producers Commission, SAS Canola, and Manitoba Canola Growers. All right, Kristen, let's we are talking depth. Okay, so uh, we often talk about as you increase your speed, you're going to get more bounce and you're going to get different seating depths within um, a seat of row. So what we're going to do is compare the three miles an hour, uh, which is on this side, to the five miles an hour on this side and see what we find. Okay. So again, we, we dug up the foot of row and then we're checking the depth here. And so this one was the three miles an hour. And you can see here that we range in depth from a half inch seating depth to the longest being about an inch and a quarter um, on 10 plants. That was what was in that foot of row. And then when we go over to the other side, um, which was sown at five miles an hour with the same drill, um, we have 13 plants and we range anywhere from one inch seating depth up to about two and a quarter inches of seeding depth. So a lot more variability here with a lot more of the seeds being, you know, 10 of them being uh, deeper than they were supposed to be. And really, is this what you expected to see? Yeah, the faster, the faster you're moving that drill across the, the field, uh, the more variability you're gonna have. And so that's kind of where we, you know, make that recommendation of if you're gonna go a, uh, you know, a half a mile faster, you might want to go another half a pound per acre of seed so that you decrease that variability. And where does variability really come in to play as far as, is it an issue with crop staging? Is it an issue with, um, say, harvest management? Where does it really play a role? The biggest thing is putting the energy into the plant, right? This plant's had to put a lot more energy to push this out of the ground compared to something like this. So it's already using energy and reserves that it doesn't need to use. Um, and then, yeah, obviously crop staging, it's going to emerge at different times the deeper it has to come from. Great. Thanks so much, Kristen.